10 million experience are achieved and welcome to my new Deadman progress video and yes yeah, so this is my first time I ever hit over 10 million experience in an official runescape game and yeah this is a bit weird I guess but anyways 10 million experience are achieved on Deadman and I'm quite proud of it but anyways we got 70k to start off this episode 95 thief thing we're almost 96 so I guess let's get that level up one more thief attempt and we should be 96 there we go three levels away from 99 and yeah we got 90k cash so that's quite good as well and I guess I'm going to stay for one more level one million experience I believe we can do that and yeah after that we're probably going buy our first dragon long swords we're going to invest all the money into them Hopefully we can afford two of them, but anyways, let's get that level. Okay guys, the time arrived, 97 Thea Thing should be achieved very soon. There we go, 97 Thea Thing, and we are two levels away from 99, but we're probably not going to get that in this episode, I don't have that much time to get that up to 99. Since we're looking forward to get some quests done as well, and yeah. I, I would suggest now to go to Xanaris, get two Dragon Long Swords, and after that we're going to start with the first achievement. Let's go and do that. Alright, finally we arrived to Jukat, and unfortunately I didn't knew that we need to pay a diamond to get into this area where this guy is who's selling the Dragon Long Swords. But anyways, we bought two of them, and yeah, I'm quite happy about that. I'm going to Lumbridge Bank now and I'm going to put them into the deposit box and yeah I'm quite happy about that and yeah after that we are probably going to start with some range and mage leveling but yeah let's put them first into the deposit box okay let's put these two beautiful long swords into the deposit box there we go and we have three dra rune scimitars one dragon dagger and two dragon long swords so that's around 304k so quite good to be honest and hopefully we're not going to die too many times in this episode otherwise we have to sell some of these items but anyways it's time to start our combat pros progress now and i guess i'm going to start with some range leveling but anyways i'll see you then 55 range is achieved and yeah quite cool we are at the ardung zoo so this is a quite good area to be honest to if you want to train in a safe zone so i could suggest you to come here and yeah, it's guarded and everything, so you don't have to be scared of anything. Pretty nice area. Alright guys, so small update there. We hit 59 arranged. Um, yeah, we just hit that level and we got we ran out of arrows. So we need to go and buy new arrows to get that level 60 I'm aiming for. But anyways, we're going to start leveling some mage and defense now. Um, I'm looking forward to get 45 defense and hopefully around 60 mage. That would be quite cool. Please attack him, thank you. Um... Yeah, I'll see you whenever we probably hit 55 uh, HP or 45 defense, I don't know. But we are 55 combat, so we are going good. I, I feel for that we're going good. Alright guys, we just hit 55 mage, 55 HP and 43 defense. We have a common level of 56, so yeah, we're getting the gains. And yeah, so the next HP level up is going to take a while, I guess. But I think the next achievement we're looking for is 45 defense. And after that, we're going straight for 60 mage. And that's it probably for our combat leveling then. Anyways, let's get these levels done. Alright guys, there we go. 45 defense is achieved. And yeah, for the last achievement we're looking for is 6... No, no, actually, yeah, 60 mage. And that should be achieved very soon as well. And 56 combat for now, that's pretty nice as well. And I guess let's go and get a 60 mage. Alright, there we go, 60 mage is achieved as well, and yeah, pretty nice, 60 mage, 59 range, I will get that 60 range probably later on in the video. And yeah, I would say now we're going to start with some questing, I'm looking forward to get the Dragon Slayer quest done, hopefully in this episode. And yeah, let's start with some questing to get these 32 uh, quest points requirements done, and I'll see you then. First quest that we're finishing is Cook's Assistant, pretty easy quest, 300 cooking experience, 1 quest points, we're at 25 quest points we need seven more until we can start the drink slayer quest let's go all right which is house is complete as well 6.3k hp experience and four quest points we are 29 so we need three more quest points and yeah really nice 57 hp let's have a look if we got any combat level up 57 i guess not Last quest for this episode is achieved as well. Um, Demon Slayer quest, three quest points, silver light, not too bad. 
took about like 20 minutes so i can really recommend if you're looking forward to get some quest points so we got 32 quest points and now we got all the requirements that's basically all the only requirement we need to um enter the champion skill we need 32 quest points we got that all right i would say let's start the quest now all right we just jumped on the boat mr nat is going to be our captain for this small journey here and yeah, we're traveling to Grandor, where we're going to fight against Elwark, the dragon. And clouds surrounded the ship. That's not looking very good. This is the, the cabin boy here. And oh shit, did you see that? See what? I saw something. And is he going to... Oh my god, we're getting attacked from the dragon. This is not looking good. Oh my god, what in the hell is going on there? Oh, he died. The captain boy died. Rip man. Oh my god. Alright, so there we go. We are on the island. Let's go and fight that bad boy. Holy crap, this Elwark is overpowered as fuck. Um, like, when I made this quest on my normal old school account, um, I, I, I was like 40 combat and I'm 57 right now. And we're getting wrecked by this Elwark. So, another 7, he's hitting constantly on us. I don't know what's wrong at the moment. But I don't think that we're going to be able to kill him. So, I'll, wait, I'll try to save spot him somehow. Um, let's change this major very fast. Oh my god, another six. Alright, so I guess we need to get better gear and as well better food. Otherwise, uh, I don't think that we are able to kill this L work thing. Oh my god, okay, let's try to safe spot that anyways. Okay, hopefully this safe spot is going to help at all. But I don't know why this attack speed of him is, is so freaking insane, man. Holy shit, like, oh my god, I can't believe that. We're using anti-fire shield and he's still hitting so much on us. A 10? Did he fucking hit a 10 on us? Okay, we're going to die. Are we, like, holy crap, man. This is even worse here in the safe spot. Okay, oh my god, I don't want to die. Please, God. Oh my god, all right, I, I, I think we should run. Okay, let's run, let's run. Otherwise, we're going to die. 5 HP. Oh my god, we're dead. We're so dead. Oh my god, please survive. Run, man, run 5 HP. Did we survive? Yes, we survived. Shit, the freaking skeleton is attacking us. Oh my god, hopefully they can't hit a three, man. Oh my god, we need to teleport to Lumbridge somehow. Um, I guess... Yes, I think we survived. Let's teleport. Is it... Can we teleport? No, 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 you fucking skeleton. Move away. Okay, I think it's looking good. Oh, no, he's not aggroing. Okay, perfect. I guess we need to rebuild a bit. Um, regear and yeah, let's go. Alright guys, I've decided to go back to Ardung and get this level 60 out of the way. And yes, well, we made 28k gold. So we're going now back to Lumbridge. We're going to buy the, the, the bone crossbow. And then hopefully we can go and buy some lobsters. And after that, we're going to attempt again against Elwark. And hopefully we're going to finish this quest. And yeah, I would say let's go and grab this crossbow first. Oh man, he just he just locked in in front of my face. I was running to buy the nails to repair the boat again. And he's freaking 88 level and I'm not sure if we're going to survive this. I'm just spam clicking the cake. But I have no idea if we're going to survive that. 88 combat, freaking dragon skirt and everything already. And oh my god, this is going to be really close. Hopefully he's not going to hit the barrage on me. Oh man, he hit the freaking barrage on me. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ah, uh, hopefully we're not going to die. Oh man, run man, 18. Alright, these freaking cakes are so useless. Oh my god. 8 HP and 7. Alright, I think we're dead. <laughs> Trout, he's even laughing at me, man, that we're using Trout and that shit. Oh man, good fight. There you go, we died. For fuck's sake, we just lost everything we made in the last two hours. And, alright, so from the levels we didn't lose too much. 3 mage levels, 3 defense levels. I guess that's okay. Alright, let's have a look into our bank, and we lost basically everything, um, oh nice, we have still our Eversic accumulator, not too bad I guess, and let's have a look into, oh shit man, oh shit, there is someone, kick him to the death, let's see, this is going to be our kill, 47, good fight man, that would be funny if this is going to be our kill, nope, it's not, it's not, what in the hell is this guy doing here, what in the hell is going on, what in the hell is going wrong here, did we get the kill, no we didn't, good fight, Alright, um, in the disposal box we still have our two Dragon Longswords and the Dragon Dagger and three Rune, uh, rune Skimitars. So I guess that's not too bad, but I guess I'm going to end this episode here. I don't have any more time to go and rebuild and get all these items done for this episode. And yeah, that's why we are going to stop the video here. If you enjoyed it, 
Feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate it. I'm putting really much time into these vids. And I really like making these videos. So yeah, feel free to leave a like. And I'll see you probably next Saturday with a new progress video. And until then, hopefully, we will have maybe 99 Thief thing and the Dragon Slayer quest. That would be cool. Anyways, thanks for watching everyone. And peace, Sereno.